Hello everyone and welcome. Today we're flying towards the west in 60 to 80 feet of bottom depth in the southern part of Hood Canal from the Belfair area all the way up to Tawana State Park and we're looking at the seafloor of what type of marine life do we have living on the bottom of the seafloor. That flounder, isn't that something to see? And if I give you our GPS coordinates, you'll know exactly where we're sitting off a of Happy Hollow. What a neat area. A lot of marine life on top. These fun-loving family of otters. Isn't that something? And fast, quick. I had to slow it down to get this shot. <laughs> Birds of all types sit on floats out here that you'd normally anchor to. You're looking at a squid nest. Some youngster was out diving with a mask and pulling up the kelp <laughs> and showing off of these eggs and to his friends. And I happened to be over there and kind of explained to him that these are real important to leave alone and not remove from the seafloor. So not only did we stop this, but we had a little bit of an educational class with a group of youngsters, and it was fun to see them out in the water swimming and enjoying the Tawana State Park. But there is some concerns with our low oxygen levels and high temperature readings on these low tides. You get a big low tide at 97 degrees off of this GPS coordinating here, and that mud flat heats up on them 100 degree days. Then you get the incoming tide over that hot mud. And I had an 87 degree reading in the Belfair area, way down at the mouth of the Union. We're moving up now towards the north. You might have heard of this before, the Duado. And here are some abandoned crab pots that we were able to get out of the water. And nothing but shells. Now this is something that's been really bothering me, and I've talked about it in another times I've been sharing with you on the Hood Canal crabbing. Please do not remove the front pincher. And I see it all of the time. So luckily we can throw him back and he'll start to survive. But this is mostly what we see when we remove these derelict pots. Thank you for watching and I got some more stuff coming about the sisters just south of the Hood Canal Bridge. Bye bye.